Hello, today I want to talk about our new feature, the All Files Library, and this is now available in version 1.99, which you can check if you tap this little circle dot icon on the home screen here. It will tell you the version number right there. So I'm on 1.99.1. And what it is, is a library of videos and files across all of your people in your Onform universe. You'll notice as I look closely, you can see Andrea, Savannah Jump Team, as well as other people, Peyton Fisher, Bobby Johns, things that are shown across all of your uh, individuals over here on your teams and individuals list. So you can still tap into Bobby Johns to see just the videos in that person's account, or I can scroll down to Haley Thompson, or come back and go to any team. But the All Files library makes it really handy to see all the videos that you've recorded, uh, and it's all sorted in reverse chronological order by date with these really useful, large, easy to read uh, dates there. So another really powerful feature that we've rolled out with this is you can now just record video straight in the All Files library. So I'll just record a quick, exciting video of my desk in here. So when I close the camera, you can see that that video lands here. There's a notice about long pressing to share, because remember, anything in a library is private by default. You still have to take a step to share it. But you'll notice that because we recorded this in the All Files library, it's not attached to a person. So now I can long press this video, and this is also new in version 1.99. I can tap Edit Person, and I can select anybody in my Onform universe that I want to uh, denote who is in this video. I can easily search up here in the search bar or I can add a new person straight away. So you don't have to add a workspace first. You can now do it in line with recording. So I can say add new person. We always remember the sport and role. I'll just put in Joe Schmo. And when I hit next, we still have the option to invite Joe, which would send an email uh, and a unique link to Joe where they would get the invite and install on form and be able to share with you. I'm going to say add without sending invite just for the purposes of this demo. And you'll notice down here we had the share with Joe turned on, which what that does is place that video in the chat channel with Joe. So now it comes up as tag Joe S and in the folder of Joe Schmo. So I can go hit the little back button here and you'll now see if I go down to the J's that just went past it. Joe Schmo is right here. He's not invited. Um, and here's his video in the library. You'll notice this video is also in the chat so that when he does accept the invite, he will see this immediately upon uh, connecting with you. Now remember, you can re-invite Joe by long pressing on his name and just say invite Joe. And again, it creates a unique link and hands it over to your own email system or text, etc. And from here I can you know, tap any one of my icons in order to send that uh, to them. So I could tap Gmail and it'll come up, fill in the subject and message and sends them a unique link, which they click and uh, will install on form. They log in and will connect with you. From that point on, they'll be connected with you. I'm going to discard this and the not invited will go away. Um, you'll get a notification and once they're connected, then you can communicate back and forth with Joe through this chat channel here. And in the future, when Joe comes for a lesson, you can record directly under his uh, library just for convenience and clarity. But you can always go back, I'm going to tap the top here, to the all files and record video here. And then now I could tag Joe in the future. So if I record one more exciting video of my monitor here, and when I dismiss this, again, I can long press, edit person. Now I could just type Joe. Okay, and it pulls up everybody with a J-O, but there's Joe, Joe Schmo. Do I want to share it with Joe in this case? If I choose not to share it with Joe, it will only put the video in the library, not also in the chat channel, okay? So you can see Joe's tagged. I just hit done, and there you go. All right, 
Hope you'll enjoy it. Let us know if you have any questions or feedback.